In Massachusetts, a trial judge can exclude evidence from trial if the probative value of the evidence, or just the, the relevance of the evidence essentially, is substantially outweighed uh, by the chance of it creating an undue prejudice um, among jurors. So if the evidence has little value, uh, but it is highly likely to, um, to prejudice the jury, in other words, uh, cause some sort of you know, disgust in the jury towards the defendant um, or some sort of hostility or animosity, then the judge can bar that evidence from coming into trial. The judge has a tremendous amount of discretion in making this decision and on appeal if the judge allows the evidence in and then the defendant appeals that decision the appeal or the appellate court will only overturn the lower court's decision if there is palpable error so there has to be a significant error in the judge's decision in order for the trial judge's decision to be overturned now I've written a blog post, I'm going to put it in the description below, and I give several cases where uh, the courts, the appellate courts have weighed in on this. So you could click on that, you could look at the rule itself, which is Rule of Evidence 403, and there's some links to, like I said, some of the Massachusetts cases where the court has discussed this in detail. If you have comments, leave them below, and if you have a question, for me, please send me an email.